Okay, you guys, so here is my meal. I got some edamame, which I'm so excited to eat. This is so good. It's like a garlic spicy seasoning that they put on top. And then here, this is a shrimp I've never had before. It was like sea bass and crab, um, peppers, and um, I think some avocado. And then here is just like my go-to, which is just like a crab mixture, which is so good. And then we have soy sauce. And of course, my favorite, ginger. So I will have the calories after this because I have not logged them yet. So yeah, this is my first meal for the day. Okay, you guys, it is time for my next meal. I have two cups of white rice, which came out to 400 calories. We have some bourbon chicken, came out to 200 calories, and I just have a little bit of light soy sauce. So this meal is 600 calories, and I am so pumped and bad judgment i had three slices of pepperoni pizza for 6.90 and three servings of baked cheddar and sour cream chips so this is the last thing i'm gonna be having it's the halo top red velvet which is the best okay <laughs> so calories is what i'm focused on today Okay, so we're already back with something else to eat. So these are light and airy lentil chips, dill and sour cream. I recommend these, this bag is huge. Okay, so I totally forgot to film this part, my actual food, but I didn't forget to tell you guys. I got Starbucks, I got a chai frap in grande, and then I did get two of their vanilla scones, which was, 120 each came out to 240 in total i feel like calorie wise that's really good calories for like something sweet i got a cake pop and i realized while filming this i put that i had two when i only had one i don't know why i did that um looking back i'm like dang i messed up okay so we were watching 90 day fiance and having some food that she just made some rice broccoli and this is homemade meatballs she's so good at making meatballs love that it's a garlic teriyaki sauce with sriracha um i am about to have some stovetop chicken stuffing this stuff is such a comfort food to me so yeah first meal 290 calories i have not weighed myself but okay you guys so my next meal i'm having two mini bagels Actually, two of them is a serving, which kind of surprised me, for only $2.50. And I couldn't decide. I was like, do I want sweet or salty? Like, I had no idea. So, on this one, we just have some grape jelly. On this one, we have some of the grape jelly and some just original Philadelphia cream cheese. Here, we have the um which one is this called chive and onion cream cheese and then this one so these three are cold this one i put a little bit of butter and a little bit of the cinnamon sugar stuff and i put it in the microwave for 20 seconds so this one's warm <laughs> so yeah i couldn't decide which one i wanted okay so next meal <laughs> i had in the microwave for too long but I'm okay, I'd rather it be too hot and explosive, that sounded gross, than it be cold. So this is just one of those frozen chicken burritos. It's 240 calories, and over here I have two vanilla scones, and per one is 120 calories, so it's 240, so this is 480 calories. I'm gonna go eat this, probably watch some YouTube, catch up, because I am, literally behind on every single person that i watch so that's what i'm gonna go do dinner is complete and for a roundup this is 700 calories in total okay so instead of binging on mcdonald's like i really wanted i had three servings of these dill and 
sour cream lentil chips they're absolutely amazing for three servings was 420 but it was definitely worth it because i got a lot sadly when i am in a bingy mood that is what i'm looking for i'm looking for quantity not quality i'm working on it though i promise so these are the ones that are already cut <laughs> thank you thank you so i just put the butter i probably use about mm, less than two servings probably but i'm going to log it as two servings even though i'm using less than actually I use drastically less than two servings, so I'm probably just gonna log it as a serving and a half. So now, after you do super thin layer, thin, thin, you're gonna put it in the microwave. I'm gonna put this in the microwave for like 30 seconds. Okay, while that's in the microwave, I'm gonna go weigh myself, I'll be right back. Okay, so now that the butter is melted, you're just gonna add some of your Cinnamon sugar. Doesn't need much. 325 calories after 70 long minutes. And I'm not exaggerating. The lasagna is complete. And it's so steamy, it's steaming up the camera. So there it is. Anyways, so we got Starbucks. I got a grande chai latte, which is 240 calories. I normally get the bigger one, but that's 350 calories and I don't know. I would have rather spent it on two of these cake pops. So I wanted the unicorn, <laughs> the unicorn ones, but they didn't have them, which is unfortunate. If you guys have not had the unicorn cake pops from Starbucks, do it. Um, it's the best 150 calories you'll ever have in your life. So anyways, I'm gonna go enjoy that. How many calories is this, babe? It is 625 calories. It is the sauce that she makes. Super simple, but it like tastes so good. It's honey, sriracha, and garlic. Anything else? Soy sauce. Oh, and some soy sauce. So I'm excited. We're gonna go eat this and probably watch 90 Day. Every time we eat dinner, we watch 90 Day Fiance. We're currently two episodes behind.